At first glance, Magicka looks like any other predictable fantasy game, but its creative mechanics will quickly cast a spell on even the weariest would-be wizards. Don't expect the usual tomes of quest text or loads of inventory management common to fantasy RPGs. While your stated quest is to defeat an evil wizard and save the world, there's only the faintest nod to a coherent story. Instead, plan on laughing your way through well-placed comic references to Star Trek, Monty Python, and other honored staples of geek culture as you travel through a world based on Norse mythology. <laughs> Magic, of course, steals the show, and your arsenal of spells is almost limitless, provided you can get used to the dizzying number of spell combinations you can create through your eight keybinds. These represent different elements and powers, and combining two or more of each almost always results in spectacular effects. At the simple end of the spectrum, mixing earth and fire creates a fireball. At the more complex extreme, tapping out a five-key combination of ice, arcane, energy, cold, and earth can summon an army of zombies. That is, if you found the book that teaches the spell. You usually need to type out many of these combinations on the fly, so practice and experimentation is what separates the true wizards from the tricksters. Surprender! Um, we start a Dunka Dunka right on. But be careful where you aim that fireball or lightning bolt. It's quite possible to one-shot your fellow wizards in the cooperative mode thanks to the game's use of friendly fire. Up to four wizards can party up, and full games soon devolve into a tempest of lightning bolts, fireballs, and the occasional thunderstorm. This chaos fits the slapstick narrative, and the result is a game that manages to be frustrating, challenging, and entertaining all at the same time. If you tire of the campaign, you and your fellow mages can fight off waves of beasts in the challenge mode and compete for the highest spot on the leaderboards. Yet Magicka isn't always so enchanting. The least patient among you will bristle at the old-school saving mechanics, which whisk you back to the start of a level if you fail to complete it during your last play session. The game's also got some even darker spirits to exercise in the form of a vast grimoire of bugs, ranging from lockups to glitches, which can make advancement quite the challenge. It was particularly bad for us just after launch, but we've been able to play without encountering any serious problems following the first big patch. As always in these situations, your mileage may vary. The flurry of patches, however, coming almost daily, suggests the developers are busy working out the kinks. With its $9.99 price tag, it may be worth taking the gamble either way. Magicka's clever, inspired twists on the straight-action RPG are sure to result in hours of freeform chaotic fun. The world was safe once more. Aside from the increased number of monsters attacking the good villagers.